Well, how do you do, my doll fans? Uh, this is your doll collector here, and I'm here to show you another opening box here. Now, I got my relative something from Amazon, so it combines that with what I got from me, but I'm not going to show you that. Um, back in 1995, I got for Christmas the first edition of Busy Gal Bar, Busy Gal Barbie, which originally put her outfit was put out in 1961. She looked close to having the genuine face, but recently I looked at Amazon and was on sale for half price. They reissued her again. In this case, she looks exactly the way she looked like in 1962. Her face. Uh, looks more like a 1959 face. I don't think it's silk stone, but uh, I decided to get it and I'll show it to you and uh, we'll make a comparison to it. Well, here it is. Now that, now I got my relatives thing coming out, so I'll have to put this on the side, and here is the 1959 Busy Barbie, and I don't know if she's a silkstone or not. I, I, I really don't know. Um, I'll have to open her up. No, she's not a silkstone. She's a uh, regular plastic, and she seems to have the exact face that she had back in 1959. And uh, she has the exact dressing. She even has the original, yes, yeah, she has more of the 19, she has the 1959 look with the original, uh, if you look closely, the original, um, the original uh, stand. And uh, I got it for half price, and she has her glasses. And you know how those Taiwanian, they used to make the dolls in Taiwan, and they had this picture of all these women individually painting her eyelashes. But this is a 1959 with a 62 dress. But uh, so you can say even it's, it's more like the 59 version. So we're going to take her out anyway. Now this is her. Um, back of her box. I guess I'll keep her box too. If you can see, this is back of her box and we'll take her out. Now, if you look closely, um, it says um, Barbie Busy Gal Doll Vintage Reproduction. The year was 1960. Oh, no wonder she looked 59. A bright young fashion designer emerged readily to take on the big city and her excitement of her new career. The reproduction of Busy Gal Barbie is dressed in a red suit worn over crisp pin striped blouse bodysuit. Finishing touches replica from the original style of the uh, style include a smart navy blue woven hat, even belt, toes, toe heels, black cat eye frame glasses, no retro detail has been overlooked. She wears a golden um, earrings, blue eyes, shadows, um, blue eyes shadow, and bright red finger and toe polish tucked in her portfolio of two fashion sketches. Now the 95 version that I got, the original paper has disappeared. And it says, no more than 20,000 worldwide FX26 semicolon HQA249. Now, I don't know whether it's a silkstone. So now I understand why she looks 1959. This was 1960. I forgot to mention her front cover. There's a picture of her in black and white. It says Barbie. And, uh, it says, Barbie Signature, Busy Gal TM Vintage Reproduction. Now we're going to open the package here. Get her out. And we're going to take her out. Now it comes from, it comes certificate 
Barbie's Busy Gal Dolls. This certifier Barbie Busy Gal doll was created through collaborative efforts, designer, artist, and Mattel. Uh, Barbie Signature Gold Label 2018. It's that old? Okay, now we're going to take this out. Let me take it out. Okay. Okay, that's easy. I want to tear anything up here. Now get her rubber bands. And then, wait a minute, let's, let's get her hat. Shh. Difficult. Okay, we gotta get rid of this. Oh darn, a thing is stuck. Oh, I, I got it. I got it. Yeah, I got it. Unfortunately, she doesn't have the original curly hair, the cur curl they usually put in her, because I guess they don't want to deal with it because it's so difficult. And uh, let's take her stand out. This is her stand. And. Uh, This is our little thing, a little uh, where she has her all her stuff. Oh, and it ain't tied in neither. I got to tie it now. Um, get her glasses. Okay. Here's her glasses. Very small. Yeah. Here they are. Even I think it has glass frames in it. Like not unlike that cheap one in there, it doesn't have glass frames, you see? Let's open this up. Uh oh, it's stuck. I could ask glue. Oh my goodness, it's stuck. I hate to tear it up. Okay, we got it up. We got her up. We got it. See? With glasses. And she's a lot better than the 1995 Barbie. She has her original stand instead of a cheap plastic holder that through time, um, it gets wilted. And then you put her stand like this. This is like with the other rep, 2011 replica of the first Barbie and, and the Silkstone version, which I don't got. Let's see. Yeah. Here she is, perfect little Stan. She has her nice, close to curly hair. Oops, her Stan fell apart. And uh, we're going to uh, tie it, wait a minute.
Well, here she is, put together very, very perfectly. Her glasses on, her uh, folder with her works on, and uh, right where her, uh, her traditional stand. And uh, she looks perfectly, perfectly good in this outfit. And her face is exactly like it was in 1960. See, look at her face. See how perfect it is, just like in 1960. Now, I'm going to uh, bring my 1995 Barbie down, that busy gal Barbie made comparison. I forgot to include showing the back of her dress, which is really nice. See, and even though her curler, her curl comes close, it ain't exactly the way they used to do it because it's so difficult. Now we're gonna bring her her sister and make comparisons. Here's the uh, 95 version and you make a comparison about the two glasses. These glasses here don't seem to have any uh, specks on them. While these do, they got pit specks on these don't. And uh, if you look closely at her face, it's, it's, it's made a little bit differently not exactly 1960 look. And uh, although it's the same on the dress, except her little paper is gone. And then you turn in the back and same thing except her ponytail's a little bit bigger, a lot bigger. Here's a more close, more close-up face. You can tell the difference between this doll and that doll's paint face, and that's the reason why I got her again because she's more original than that. But I do appreciate that because that was the first one. Well, if you like this show, please like, comment, and subscribe. And I hope you enjoyed my introduction to my newer version. A busy gal Barbie, which is really a gem. Bye.